Hey guys, it's Tracy. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have for you a haul from the washi tape shop. I have never uh, gotten anything from them and I had gone down a kind of like deep diving rabbit hole on bullet journals and reading journals and I came across a channel um, by a girl named Erin Smith. I will try to remember to link that down below along with the information for the washi tape shop. She uses a lot of their products uh, and it was really fascinating to watch. So I did place a small order. Um, let's see. I'm trying to remember what came with what. I think this came as a set and then this one was by itself. Okay. So anyway, they send you this really cool um, thank you card. Uh, and really neat because these are like peelable stickers that you can use. So that's neat. So I'll be able to use those at some point, which is fun. Um, I also, in here, this is a little uh, bullet journal from Michaels. I decided to go ahead and do swatches in here of all of my washi tapes. So what I want to do is kind of show you a little bit about these. So this one here is kind of a sample from this one. And let me find the edge of the tape there. I left it bent so it would be easier to find, but apparently it didn't stay that way. There we go. Um, so in any case, this is the beautiful washi tape. Has all kinds of stuff. I mean, it just, it, it doesn't repeat for quite a while. Um, so I only put down a small sample of what they were, but I really like these. Um, and basically, uh, because it's like one strip and it has like a backing, you have to cut all the stuff apart on these particular type of washi tapes. Um, the PET tape, which is what this is, is sort of like a, a almost like a plastic. Um, in any case, they're really pretty though, because they're nice and thin. But you can see like I ended up cutting that as one strip. I just like narrowed it down. Um, but you would be able to cut those apart completely. Um, some of them I did like overlap a little bit, but these are really nice guys. I really like this. So this washi tape uh, or this PET tape is called Seasons Symphony. Really nice. This next one here is Petals and Parchment. Um, and I think I just put everything on these two pages here. Yeah, I did. Okay, so you get all of these different washi tapes. So let me show you that off to the side. Actually, let me pull this up a little bit so you can see a little better. Um, really unique. And these are kind of more like a paper tape. So you get your traditional um, washi tape. So here that is. But again, it comes on a backing. So you can see like here, there's like a little wrinkle. That's where the backing is. See? If you could see that. But it's really, it's really neat. Um, I really like the quality of these washi tapes. Um, the paper is a nice thin texture, so it makes it real easy to lay these stickers down. Um, and I really, really found that interesting. Let's see. I can get this one back up again. Oh, it's pulling up another sticker. Hang on. There we go. I didn't want to waste that one. So, again, really pretty stickers, guys. Um, a lot of stamps on these little, um, like, vignettes. Really pretty. Um, you know, herbal, flower. Really, really pretty. Um, I really kind of like these. And they're a nice texture. You should be able to, like, write on them. Um, because they're that real nice paper washi texture. This one, let's see if I can get this up without, there we go. Wait a minute, what happened here? Oh, that's where like part of a sticker stuck to this. 
I'm just having uh, a weird day, guys. Like all the stuff that can go like crazy with my videos today is, okay, we're gonna move that off to the side. <laughs> But this paper tape is super pretty. It's very fragile, as you can see, but I'm really enjoying this. And uh, part of my difficulty is probably because I'm not used to dealing with these. I don't normally use washi, um, but I decided to kind of start getting into it because I thought it might be kind of fun. So we'll see what happens with all of these, but um, I don't know, you know where I'm gonna use them or how I'm gonna use them yet, but I just think they're so neat. Okay, here we go, this one's a little easier. So this is a full on strip and it just repeats. It goes through a uh, peony, uh, through like the Queen Anne's lace, lavender, and then it goes back to the peony again. But these are actual, almost like dictionary entries for the floral uh, pieces here, which I think is really, really neat. So you can actually put this down and get that real old world, like vintage book style uh, effect. So these might get used in my book journal. We'll see. I don't know yet. Um, like I said, I just, I really enjoyed them. So again, those four are the petals and parchment, which are all here. This is the wide washi here and all the other different little like stamps and things. And then this is the thinner strip. And then again, this is the season symphony, which I decided to try one of those PET tapes. Um, and I'm really kind of digging it. You know, they're they're really thin. They don't add a lot of bulk to the page. Um, so I think that those are gonna be really interesting to use. But I thought I would share it with you guys. And again, I will try to remember to link Aaron Smith's um, channel down below so you can see what other things are available. I don't know how soon I would be purchasing from them. Again, it was just something I wanted to try because I had never bought anything from them before and her videos really made it fascinating. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. I hope you'll check hers out as well. And I will talk to y'all in the next one, guys. Have a great one. Bye.